Good afternoon. Uh, this is Philippe Law speaking to you from the offices of the British Plastics Federation in central London on the afternoon of Friday, the 24th of July. I just want to spend a few minutes talking to you about the BPF's climate change agreement because this week there was a major positive development in the, the finance bill which included the original proposal for um, climate change agreement for plastics processors was actually given royal assent, which means that it's a practical certainty that the BPF will be signing a climate change agreement with the Secretary of State for Energy and Climate Change at some point in late September. To start the ball rolling, what you should do is go to the BPF's website, www.bpfenergy.co.uk. On that website, you will see a form, a relatively simple form, entitled BPF Form 1. Complete that fully and send it into the BPF on climate change at bpf.co.uk. The window of time that you've got to do this in is quite narrow and we're really keen to get as many companies through the door as possible before October the 31st, which is the final deadline. That's the ultimate cut-off date for entry into the scheme this year. If you don't meet that date, you're going to have to wait until April the 1st, 2011. Companies who are well prepared and start the process early can actually start receiving the rebate on their climate change levy as early as October the 1st. So it's in everyone's interest to start the process now. The energy efficiency targets that you'll be expected to meet will be 12% between 2006, which is the base year, and 2010. Clearly, going back to 2006 is not an easy job because you'll have to go through your company records to derive the appropriate data. The actual um, process of, of, of reviewing your data and your application is also a time-consuming one. So the earlier you start this process, the sooner you will be able to claim the, um, the rebate on the levy. From the plastics processing sector, we've already had 150 applications from companies to join this scheme. We don't want your company to miss the boat, so start now. The benefits are enormous. First of all, you can get an 80% reduction in your climate change levy. Secondly, you will save money on the energy efficiencies you make. And thirdly, you will avoid any possible obligations that you might have under the incoming government carbon reduction commitment, which applies to all companies uh, with electricity usage of over 6,000 megawatt hours. So the benefits are there, but as they say, there is no gain without pain. We don't want you to miss the boat, so start now, get onto that website and initiate the process through which you can make these cost savings and benefit to your company. Thank you for listening.